Hello to all of you. So in this lecture, we start a new chapter that called water logging and drainage. Clear? So you know that meaning of water logging. That uh, topic will discussed in first chapter. There are the topic is that called ill effects of irrigation. Clear? So there are four types of ill effects. So one of that water logging. Clear? The next goes to. So what is a water logging? When we supply a water to that particular land or soil, clear. But you supply or you distribute maximum amount of water so that the soil porous or soil voids that filled with water and there are no air circulations, clear, between the voids and porous. So there are totally cut off of uh, that particular air. And productivity of soil so that condition called water logging clear so what are the reasons so there are over irrigations then second one water table depth poor drainage systems clear the next one capillary action so what is the capillary action you uh, studied in fluid mechanics clear so it is the one type of height to which water will rise above the water table due to capillary of action that call height of capillary fringe means it indicate height of which the water level will rise above the table or water table due to which action capillary action so that height call capillary fringe clear so there are maximum height in fine soil and there are less height in coarse soil clear so in water logging that land be water log when water table is equals to 1.5 to 2.1 meter below the ground surface clear so this is the uh, conditions when water logging is occurred when the water table depth is below the ground or uh, uh, which near about 1.5 to 2.1 meter so that the conditions when water log The next one, there are various crops like a wheat, cotton, rice, sugarcane, fodder crop, and the gave depth of water table, clear, which is a for wheat 0.9 to 1.2 meter, for cotton 1.5 to 1.8, for rice 0.6, sugarcane 0.9, and fodder crop for 1.2, clear. So there are various depths according to crops. Then next causes of water logging. So there are several causes of water logging. First one over irrigations means that particular land require 500 cusack of water, but you supplied 600 cusack of water to the land. So that over irrigations occurred and due to that water logging occurred. The next one inadequate surface drainage. Clear. If that particular land have not drainage system. So water logging, water logging will be occurred. Done. So surface drainage system is very important to drain out maximum amount of water. Otherwise, to remaining amount of water. Then third one, seepage from canal. You know that canal. There are two types of canal. Clear. First one, water log. Uh, sorry, first one, line canal and unlined canal. So obviously you know that in unlined canal, seepage is maximum. But in condition when uh, in line canal, the canal breaches out means canal uh, failure. So at that time, that maximum amount of water sprayed into the land or farm. So at that time, water logging occurred. Then fourth one, obstructions of natural drainage. Natural drainage means river or like a natural channel. So there are some obstructions means some objects are put into that flowing conditions of a river or channel so that obstructions are occurred. So at that time, the water percolate to the ground and the water table rise and the air circulations or uh, porous and voids will be filled with water. Then fifth one, constructions of reservoir. You know that, what is the meaning of reservoir? So in that conditions, you construct a large dam to store water clear so at that time again same condition 
water percolate to ground and rise up or rise groundwater table then sixth one nature of soil so you know that there are different types of soil and that have a different type of capacity to retain water like a black cotton soil clay so that have a different capacity to store a water done according to that like uh, for example uh, at that particular uh, land have a sandy soil so in that conditions the water stored minimum amount and directly percolate to the ground so water logging will be maximum occurred in that soil then defective method of cultivations then defective practice of irrigations you know that what is the meaning of cultivations and what is the meaning of irrigations so that method will be improper to the land so this is a chances to occur water logging so the method and the applications of water will be proper manner so there are the causes of water logging then next one effects of water logging then first one reduction in plant growth so you know that obviously there are three things which require for growth of plant first one sun second one air and third one water you know that air circulation will stop in water logging so the plant will be da uh, dead or built so the growth of plant will be reduced then difficulty in cultivations clear so that area so that area is water logged so at that time you cultivate or you harvest some products but due to the water logging or water storage there are many hurdles or many difficulty difficulty occurs due to that water logging then third one increase in salinity you know that uh, water have sometimes uh, some amount of salt clear when the water logging occurred and after that time the water evaporate and that salt is uh, on the surface of layer or on the surface of land clear so because of that the salinity means salt level of that land will be increased due to water logging then plant disease you know that obviously mosquito nuisance and there are different types of disease of plant which increase due to water logging then fifth one fall in soil temperature you know that there are some uh, area which is already damp so that will be damper due to water logging because there are large amount of water stored above the surface then sixth one growth of weeds means unnecessary amount of plant which are grown near about that land then seventh one damp climate means that area or that land have temperature like 30 degree and due to the water logging the temperature will be increased means the temperature will be colder or damp so 25 degree so due to that that area temperature or climate will be damper so there are methods or there are some measures of prevention of water logging clear the first one restrict irrigation so you should uh, use that minimize amount of method which used the water like a drip irrigation sprinkler irrigations then second one efficient surface drainage so you use a surface drainage system to that land so that system have a proper efficient effectively then third one reductions seepage from canal so at that time we will use a lime canal clear so that seepage will be reduced by some protective layers to the canal then fourth one improving natural drainage of area natural drainage means drainage is uh, used for the uh, drain of remaining amount of water clear so you should improve natural drainage system then fifth one preventions of seepage from reservoir so there are some types of method like uh, we created some levees near about the reservoir or near about the villages to protect or to prevent seepage from reservoir then sixth one changing crop pattern so this is a very helpful method to change a crop matter a crop pattern method uh, periodically 
Then seventh one, adopting well irrigation. So well irrigation, you know that in this method, we uh, extract water from the well means below the groundwater, means below the ground level. So that groundwater level is always be, uh, in some depth so that no chances to occur water logging. Then eighth one, adopting better, better method of application of water. You know that there are various methods of applications of water. We will uh, we'll discuss in third chapter methods of irrigation. So you can choose ma uh, which method we which use minimum amount of water. Then ninth one, changing assessment method. So you know that there are two types of method. Uh, first one, volumetric, area basic, uh, seasonal basis, betterment levy. Clear. So, volumetric method is based then to assess a water or irrigation's water. So there are nine measures of prevention of water logging. So there are various types of chemical will be used uh, for water logging. Clear. Or for land reclamations. There are drainage system. You know that what is the drainage system? Drainage system means to remove extra amount of water of irrigations. Clear that color drainage system. So there are two diagrams which show the drainage system clear. So at the end of the field, there are some levees or some field channels are provided for remove extra amount of water clear. So there are some longitudinal slope will be provided for the drainage of water. So there are some classifications of drainage system. So first one surface and subsurface drainage system. In surface drainage system, first one silo open drains and deep open drains. So you know that what is the meaning of surface drainage and subsurface means surface that color above the ground level and subsurface means below the ground level. So there are diagrams that is, that is called, uh, there are diagrams, you know that the surface drainage system. So in surface drainage system, the remaining means removing extra amount of water by the above the surface. But in subsurface drainage system, the remaining amount of water removed by below the ground water level system like this one that color closed drain means that pipe are provided below the ground level. So that color closed drain which are used to remove extra amount of water. So that are perforated pipe so that extra amount of water will be collected by this pipe and this pipe remove the water to the uh, to the end clear so this is a closed drain system the next one salinity of soil so what is the meaning of salinity you already know already know that because i discussed before some times before moments ago so what is the reason behind occur of solid salinity of soil clear so that water table rise otherwise groundwater table rise and you know that there are some amount of salt are stored in the uh, what water so after that the water evaporate and that uh, salts are deposit on the surface of the water or surface of the ground level so that color salinity of soil clear and due to that the crop production will be decreased so there are some causes first one rise of ground water table then second one use of saline water Third one, poor drainage system. Fourth one, excessive seepage from canal and sea in, uh, water interface. Clear. Then the sixth one, in arid and semi-arid climates, there are high evaporation of water from the land surface. So there are total six reasons behind salinity of soil. Then next one, land reclamation. So what is the land reclamation? Means land restorations. Clear. So that process of Restoring productivity and fertility of the land that call land reclamations. Clear? So there are uh, various method or there are uh, various measured various steps for land reclamations. Second one, drainage and lowering water level, water table. So how can you do that? So you should uh, use uh, well irrigations. Clear? then provide a natural drainage system or artificial drainage system like open drain, closed drain. Then th second one, leaching. You know that, what is the meaning of leaching? That discussed in a second chapter when we'll discuss about uh, crop irrigation requirement. 
Clear? So, how much depth of water you applied in leaching? 15 to 25 centimeter and it repeated after 4 to 5 years. Then third one, use chemicals like a gypsum and calcium chloride. Then fourth one, crop rotations. Then fifth one, adopting rice cultivations. Sixth one, use agriculture waste product, proceed coil, green manuring and ninth one, electrolysis. So there are some types of measures which used for the land restorations. Clear? So there are the topics which include in water logging. Clear? Thank you.